So, welcome to Cesar video blog. In this um, journey, we will um, look at a device that uh, invaded the markets for quite a long time. We will look inside. It's a USB uh, hub. High speed. We will see that. I don't know. Let's take it apart. Okay, no screws. I see no screws. Okay, we are in. So we took off the um, the cover. And what do we have inside? Inside we have So we have ground here 5 volt in the middle which is going there to the USB connector data negative and data positive and the ground wonderful no protection whatsoever this black strips looks like they are resistors they are resistors for the leds see from the power to the leds see every led has an, a resistor this is not populated one capacitor is not populated so there are seven ports two chips they are active hubs let we will try and find what chip is it but um, from what we see here i don't know if on the other side will be anything we will see soon enough but from what i see it looks like um, a power hub uh, usb one maximum two could be and uh, everything integrated in the in the chip the pcb design is hmm, yeah there but it's messy never cleaned it's flux all over flux uh, all over the the place uh, flux all over yeah that's for sure so we have a true hole design fitted with the um, smd leds which is not bad so um, only one capacitor we will try and see what uh, is the uh, ic oh yeah okay so can you hear the buzz hope you can okay so we will have a data pin here exactly see so one pin here it's uh, is the one responsible for see is the one responsible for cascading so cascaded uh, uh, like that from one hub to the other hub which is not ideal This is it, guys. Take it out from the from the cover and uh, examine the the top side. So the top side is just a plain PCB. Bottom side 
uh, we should see soldering quality flimsiness of this board is like oh my god yeah so this every everything is flimsy everything is flimsy see so yeah light pipes nothing special mostly nothing inside other than the um, chips and the connectors it's good as a breakout board um, I promise that I will show you the, the schematic I will show you the schematic from the data sheet okay this is the, the block stuff uh, we have four ports we have a USB repeater four ports so it should be no problem in theory it has uh, everything power on reset internal regulators oscillator everything inside one chip you only need the, like um, close enough so this is the schematic provided by the manufacturer and this is by the book copying the data sheet there is no other way to implement this other than you can add some protection uh, reverse polarity protection maybe there is some cable that is reversed polarity using reverse polarity like center negative and you blow up the stuff uh, maybe a fuse maybe some fast diodes for the data lines to protect them i don't know i don't know really okay with this i want to say uh, thank you for uh, watching yeah okay so we will have this thank you for watching Bye.